it's it's Wednesday. They started running together out here on the road. Kind of close that damn thing. Well, James Best did it again. He was up and running like he was just up and running, full of piss and vinegar. When I woke up. already going live, which that was a nice little morning bizarre. But hey, James is up and live. What's he up to? He could be on for an hour. He could be on for 12. He's just an entertaining, fun personality. So, you've seen me, and you're actually following me, and you're watching me, go give James a like or a watch. I will warn you, PG-13, nine times out of ten, and he gets riled up. And if you're not part of the trucking scene and you start watching, there is drama. Like an old lady's knitting circle. But if you stay out of the drama, it's pretty entertaining.
let me uh, enlighten you into a, we'll call it a, a monster, all right? And I believe these are in Asia or South America. I'll have to double check. And I'm probably butchering this name. I believe it's Irapaima or Mirapaima. I can't remember if it's with an M or without an M. But it's catfish species. They get about three, four hundred pounds. We're talking a catfish that would eat a small child. And they've been known to do that. They've been known to eat people's dogs to get near the riverbanks. Like we're talking a monster catfish. And it is in the catfish family. It has the whiskers. And it uh, kind of likes to stay down in the murky bottom on occasion, but catfish kind of go everywhere. They're just known for kind of sitting and waiting. Well, here at Pima, they're not so much a scavenger as they are a hunter. And what's really cool about the Arapaima, I'll double check this, like I'll throw up a picture somewhere. They look more like an eel in the sense that they don't just have a single tail. Or they don't have a, they don't have a body that goes to a tail with a typical fish in tail, no. Their bodies kind of taper to a point and about midway down their back and their belly, they've got a dorsal tail that runs all the way to the tip. So, like, their propulsion fin, or their tail fin, is a good length of their body. So, they're big. They're pretty smart for a fish. They're decently fast. And you could probably feed a family of five with one for a couple weeks. So there you go. Here at Pima. Again, I'll pull up a picture and I'll I'll put up the spelling and double check my facts. But I know they get big. If you ever want to want to see a big fish, just Google catfish species. I think there's there's about ten to twenty different species of catfish, and all of the ones outside of North America, USA, get over a hundred pounds. We're talking four or five hundred pound catfish. Yeah, there's your little tidbit for the morning.